hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here then welcome join the family click the subscribe button down below all right so today i'm coming at you with my q a video yes i'll be answering some questions that you guys sent me on instagram as well as some questions that i got from pinterest so let's go right ahead firstly let me say uh my name is meshika and i am from the beautiful island of jamaica all right so this here let me talk about this here this is a kinky curly wig it is a closure wig uh yeah and kinky curly by kinky curly it means that the curls are much tighter than say a deep wave here or a body wave here or even a deep curly here so that is the difference if you have any questions you can always ask me further but let's go right ahead into those questions all right so question number one what is your zodiac sign i am a libra my birthday is october 13th three what's your sexual orientation trait four how tall am i i am five feet five inches and some others things uh what's your favorite quote my favorite quote is only your best is good enough yeah. all right so the next question do i have a crush no i don't have a crush when i was much younger primary school high school primary school yeah not now what's your favorite food my favorite food is curry goat stew peas and shrimp pasta do i use sarcasm do you use sarcasm do i use sarcasm do you use sarcasm of course i use sarcasm <laughs> uh, what am i listening to right now uh probably it's jeremy edwards uh, hallelujah i love that song mm, i think that would be it that's that's what i listen to most times in the morning also my cousin mordecai music he has a song that i really love to listen to in the mornings as well so yeah uh shoe size my shoe size is nine ever done a prank call i don't think so if I have ever done one, it would be when I would when I was younger, probably on a friend or something. But no, I've never done a prank call. Favorite movie? My favorite movie is The Notebook. I love romance films. I love romance novels. I love romance series. So if you have any suggestions, you can leave them down below. I can check them out as well, especially since we're in quarantine and on lockdown. I have nowhere to go. I have nothing to do. You can leave them down and I check them out. I was watching Quantico. I don't know what happened with that. I was really hoping to see, you know, the other seasons of Quantico, but I haven't seen it. I've been waiting on Queen of the South like forever, but I don't see Queen of the South come out as yet. I don't know what's happening with that. Um, but yeah, you can leave your suggestions down below. I really love romance films, series, whatever it may be. My relationship with my parents when my father is deceased i have a very good relationship with my mother she's like my best friend my favorite holiday my favorite holiday would definitely be christmas time though i really love christmas time because it's a time for family it's a time for just eating enjoying itself music fun and reflecting on the birth of christ so that would definitely be my favorite time and the holiday is still boxing day we get boxing day right after christmas so it's an extended time and then you have new year's coming around the corner yo fireworks ringing in the new year yeah christmas time is my is the, is the best holiday for for me all right so guys my daughter is having a zoom class right now so i hope you're not hearing that in the background but if you are then i sincerely apologize all right so on to the next question tattoos and piercing that i have i have no tattoo uh i've always wanted to get a tattoo since i was much younger but i'm just so scared of the pain of getting a tattoo um i don't know i just think that i'd run out of the tattoo chair when that tattoo artist come with the needle to put it on my skin no i couldn't i'd probably get heart failure so no i don't have any tattoo uh i do have piercings i have one two three four five six seven piercings so yay i probably get another a second one down here 
I've wanted a nose pierce. Like, I don't know. I've wanted so many other pierces, but I just don't get them. I can't bother with the pain. Uh, I like this one here. I like this one. And I like the nose piercing. Yeah, I'd get those, but no, not. I'm too old for that. Last book I read, like, I really don't remember the name of it right now. I'll put the name when I am when I'm editing this video in the description. I don't remember it right now, but it's a book about self-development and I really love to take time out to read those kind of books. Developing oneself. I I like the idea of spending time on myself and doing whatever that I can do to you know make myself a better person, whether it's through education, whether it's through physically building my body or whatever. I just believe in one's development as a person all right and i encourage all my one fam to 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 take that approach as well all righty good morning text or good night text like guys what do you prefer what do you like put down below what you like because for me i want both i want to get the text as i wake up in the morning and i want to get a text good night every night that's how i am and I love sending those texts as well. Have I ever kissed the last person that I texted? Alright, so let's see who's the last person that I texted. Well, I'm going to my phone because I really don't remember who the last person was that I texted. Mm -mm -mm -mm. No. <laughs> to one of you, the last person I texted. And, and that's Jordan Chrome on YouTube, guys. Check her out. That's Jordan Chrome. That's the last person that I texted and we haven't ever kissed. <laughs> Alright, let's go back into these. How long does it take me to get ready in the morning? Alright, so there are times when I oversleep. This is like for a normal day when we have work and all. There are times sometimes, guys, when I oversleep. When I do that, like say, I know I'm supposed to be leaving out in 15 minutes then i'm going to be flush 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 that's why i like to have my wigs or i just sketch up my hair i just like to have a simple style for my head most times right so it would take me like 15 minutes the most if i know that i oversleep and i'm running really late take 15 minutes the most to get get up out of bed get ready and everything and out the house all right if i'm not doing makeup and it's a regular morning for work like 30 minutes and i'm out if I'm doing my makeup like one and a half hours, it will take me to get out the house. Have I shaved my legs in the past three days? No. To be honest, I haven't shaved my legs since I stopped going to work. So no, and that's like two to three weeks. So no, I really need to, to, to do that. Where am I right now? In my bedroom. Do I? Do I like my music loud or at a reasonable level? That's loud, baby. It's loud, baby. Loud all the way. I don't listen to music reasonable. Like, the other day, my daughter, she had a Zoom class at home. And I was in my room listening to my music and I had my headsets in. And I was just singing and just, uh, I was just all into it. My mother had to come and tell me that, hey, listen, you're disturbing the class downstairs. I was like, oh. Sorry, I didn't really, I really didn't realize. So I listened to my love, my music really loud. All right, so my next question, and I'm almost done now. My next question: Do you have children? Yes, I have a child. I hope I can have two more, two more children. Do you smoke? No, I don't smoke. I try vape, but I would try vape, but I don't think that it is all the way safe. And so I just kind of just stick to my drinking. That's it. What do you love most about yourself? I love the fact that I am so humble. I am a hard worker and I am very ambitious. I'm not born rich, but I'm not dead poor. That's my slam. And that's from Pipes Cartel. Uh, what makes you feel the best about yourself? My eyes, I think I have beautiful eyes. Uh, my smile, I think I have a beautiful smile as well. And my legs, I think that they are super sexy. 
where I'd like to where I'd like to live. I'd like to live Jamaica of course in the countryside Manchester. I spend some time there and my family's from Manchester as well and I really love it down there. It's really cool, calm, outside of the hustle and bustle like in the Kingston side. It's not it's it's the opposite of Kingston. And so I really like that. I would definitely live there for retirement. Alright, so next question. Why did you start your channel? I started my channel because I think I I talk so much in my head and I, I think I want to record these voices in my head. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I think that I, I started my channel to I've always been watching YouTube videos, makeup videos, lookbook videos try and haul videos styling videos i've always been watching those videos from i was much younger so i thought to myself rather than watching why don't i become the person being watched <laughs> yes yeah, so that's another reason why i started my channel i started my channel also because i'd love to inspire somebody if it's even one person through makeup really then and 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 self-confidence through makeup then i would have accomplished my reason for starting my channel because i believe so much in women female empowerment and self-worth self-empowerment self-confidence you know I, I i believe that listen females in jamaica them say is look good time now and that is in fact true because to get your hair done can be like Back in the days, it used to be so very expensive now. The, like, the resources are just there for you to grab, to fix up yourself, right? So you can get a hair done for little or nothing, or you can, there are all these tutorials out there, you can just look at them, see, oh, like, if you, can, if you don't know how to braid or plait or whatever, you can look at some other one, glue on ear, whatever, you know, makeup. You don't have to be using the finest brand of makeup. Like, look at me, I use this very cheap, stuff to do my makeup you know and i'm sure my makeup still look good right so yeah that's one of the reasons why i started my channel what kind of driver are you i tell that i'm an okay driver i don't like to drive slowly but i drive the speed limit I don't want to get no tickets i've gotten two tickets i hope i'm not jinxing myself i've gotten only two tickets in my driving career What's your pet peeve? Dirty nails. Dirty nails. <laughs> and slurping. Person making noise and they're drinking something. Alright, somebody had asked me as well, what do I use on my face? I use very I use a variety of things on my face. So brand makeup that I use most times though is Maybelline and MAC and my LA girls for my highlights and so on uh, somebody also asked me do you need to contour and I say yes you definitely need to contour if you do apply product to your face that is foundation then you need to highlight and contour and I say this because and this is something that I learned while going to makeup school right and I think it's really logical you look at your face i'm sure that you know that you, you'd realize that there are there are some here the here is that the ears that we highlight they are lighter like here here because of the way the sun hits the face right and these ears that we contour they are naturally darker so when you go ahead and apply foundation to your face you are like putting your face in one set tone which means you are removing any lighter areas that is on your face and the darker areas that's on your face you're putting them in one color after doing that you need to go ahead and reapply or put back the natural color of your face the natural setting up of your face back in so you need to go back and highlight the areas that were highlighted and go ahead and contour the ears that are to be contoured right or apply a darker shade to the areas that are naturally darker so that's the reason why you highlight and contour if you go ahead and apply foundation to your face that's in my view that's my take on it 
because that gives you the most natural look like there's nothing i hate to see more than some a female with just foundation on her face it just look like one round circle to me when i see somebody like that like you need to put back the definition in your face all right okay all right so i think i'm at the end of my video right now guys i hope that you enjoyed this well you almost enjoyed because you guys asked me these questions if you want spicy questions answered then send spicy questions all right i will answer whatever you guys send uh yeah so thank you so much for watching this video i hope to see you back for my next video like join the family like subscribe share comment like like interact with me because i want to learn from you just as much as i want you to learn from me all right so bye guys thank you so much for your support again all right remember to thumbs up smash that bell also guys for post notifications please Put the bell on all so you get when you get to see when all my videos are being dropped okay bye team one fam team one fam